What's up YouTube, this is Tube Digger. In this video, I'm gonna show you my quick workaround to get rid of the current end of sequence glitch that occurs when you've recorded automation onto a track in your MPC. This is a known bug in MPC 2.3. Hopefully Akai are working on it, but in the meantime, this is the quickest workaround to get rid of the bug so it doesn't kill your creativity. So to demonstrate this, I'll play back this simple four bar sequence and you can see that it's playing back and looping perfectly. So I'm gonna put the MPC into write automation mode. I'm gonna to go to program editor and I'm just gonna automate the semi-tunes for the entire program. Now it doesn't matter where in the sequence that you record the automation and it also doesn't matter which parameter that you adjust. This click will appear at the end of the sequence regardless. And you can hear that audible timing delay and click at the end of the sequence where it loops now. So if we press erase and erase the automation, this does not get rid of it. It just gets rid of the automation itself, but the actual bug is still in memory. So let's record the automation again. So as I showed you, it doesn't matter if you erase the automation, you're just gonna lose the automation. You don't need to do that. You can keep the automation if you're happy with it. To get rid of the bug, you just literally press and hold shift, save your project, go to browser, load the project back in, and the bug is gone. and you've retained any automation. So let's just go back to program edit and let's automate the filter cutoff for this snare sound. I just wanted to show you that just so you can see that it doesn't matter which parameter that you adjust or whereabouts in the sequence that you actually record the automation, you still get the glitch, but it occurs at the end of the sequence. I just didn't want you to get confused and think that because I'd automated the sequence at the end. In fact, I actually didn't. You might notice if you play the video back to where I actually automated it, I let go of the cue link before it actually looped over. So it doesn't matter which parameter or whereabouts in the sequence that you write the automation. So once again, press and hold shift, save, go to browser, load it back in, all the automation with the pitch and the filter will be retained, but the click will have gone now. And that's it guys, that's the simplest and quickest way to get rid of this current glitch in MPC 2.3. Please like, share and subscribe. If you want private tuition with myself, please contact me at tubedigger at gmail.com for more details. I'll see you on the next one. This is Tube Digger and I'm out.